I'm working in the forest ecology lab, and we do a lot of work, uh, obviously, in the forest, looking at climate change and how that's um, affecting the forest around here. We have a, a very large campus um, right, a forest around us. It's also a wildlife preserve. Uh, well, I have a professor um, at SUNY Plattsburgh who uh, told me about the REU program and, and directed me to their website. And uh, I applied for a few of them, and, and this was the the one that I really wanted. I think you know it's a very prestigious institution. In, in 2010. Um, the, the people in the Canopy Lab, which is what they call the Forest Ecology Lab, um, found out that the forests around here are growing faster than normal. So uh, basically what I'm doing is I'm going uh, back through all kinds of uh, tree core records that they had, as well as taking some of my own tree core records, um, and seeing if I can figure out exactly when and why this extra growth started. It's just great to be out in the field um, a, a lot, and, and I'm, I'm learning so much about um, some of the standard uh, software programs and things that, that uh, are standard for the industry, um, SAS and Sigma Plot for statistics and graphing sort of things, and, and R, I've uh, done a little bit in R as well. It's amazing. I mean, I, I was really blown away when I, when I first got out here. It's such an environment of just creative collaboration between all these different labs. Um, a lot of what CERC does is, is marine sort of estuary ecology. Um, so the people that are more land-based, like the Canopy Lab and the, uh, the Terrestrial Ecology Lab, they work together a lot. Um, so we have lab meetings every couple weeks and just discuss what we're working on. Uh, so it's just, it's just an amazing collaborative um, environment here. You know? They have a dorm, so I mean, it's a two minute walk to work in the morning and you're just completely immersed in, in what you're doing, so it's really nice. Just apply and, and just be honest. I mean, I think they're looking for, for intelligent people who are, who are self-starters, um, but, and, and don't be afraid to call people. I think that's one of the, the lessons that I learned here is, uh, you know, one phone call is worth 10 emails. <laughs> Absolutely, yes. I, I would come back again if I was allowed to. Um, it, it's just been an amazing experience for sure.